and so I've been absent for a little while. Um, life, job and being full of cold has kind of got in the way. I'm still getting over my cold. I've come out in a gorgeous cold sore. Thank you so much. Don't you just love biology? But here I am with a video. This is a little late, but it's my May TBR. First up, TMS Wrath by James S.A. Corey. This is book eight in the Expanse series. Um, I haven't got very far in it this week because I keep falling asleep. So I'm currently on catch up, but we're already quite happily playing our way through. Love this series. If you want something meaty, fun, character driven in space, the Expanse series is brilliant. Leviathan Wakes is the first one. Best of Boys by Mary Webber. This was last March's Fairy Loot book. I haven't actually read this. I missed the read along. I read Viper instead, which was the other book in the box. This is a Greek style labyrinth adventure story with girls pitted against boys. Sounds fun. And there's Nightblood by Ellie Blake, book three in the Frostblood series. I know this has been on my TBR for months now. I will get round to this, I promise. Then there's Slayer by Kirsten White. This is a new reboot kind of thing of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. For those of you under 30 and no idea what I'm talking about, please go and check out the series because it's awesome telly. Um, Every generation a slayer is born, she who would defend the world against the darkness and the vampires. This follows a new slayer. And then the next three books I've actually already read this month. So I had Norse Mythology by Neil Gaiman. This is a kind of a retelling of some of the original stories from Norse mythology, specifically following the likes of Thor and Loki. The Girl King, my mini you. Um, I really enjoyed this. This is a nice, big, fantasy-driven story about sisters, magic, and it's full of Eastern influences. Really, really good. And then there was Truth Witch by Susan Denard. I've been wanting to read this purely because of the original covers. I hate these new ones. I don't like covers that do this. I prefer a cover that tells me the story. And this, you know, it, it's an emblem. I'm sure it's very, very pretty and lots of people like it, but it doesn't do anything for me. Anyway, purely a cover pickup. So my husband found this in the library system for me. He got it. Um, I've read it within three days. I love it. I've got to get the rest of the series. So that's my TBR for the month. As you can see, I'm already nearly halfway through. So that's kind of good. I feel quite positive about that. Certainly with my new job, I'm on the bus for about an hour each way. So I get a lot of reading done, which is really nice. Um, I'm also being given lots of books to read because of being a school librarian. I kind of need to know what we've got in stock. So my boss has been um, giving me books to try and see what I think of. And I've read so many books recently. It's incredible and really nice. So there we go. What are you reading this month? Let me know. Links to your TBRs down below, please. Um, you can find all my social media and book blog links in the description box. And you can find a link to a small booktuber that I think you should go and check out. As always, thank you very much for watching and happy reading. Bye.